was a youngster, or teenager, um, I was a big flying uh, music fan and um, used to go to the shows, but I used to record a lot of them as well um, on a, a little Walkman. And at the same time, take a few snaps, um, still photographs, which you had to develop, of course, back in the day. So I ended up having all these recordings over the years, and I wanted to do something with them because they're not much use these days on tapes. So hence is why I'm digitising the whole my whole massive collection of uh, Dunedin bands and a few other bands as well, New Zealand bands as well. Yeah. Oh yeah, I always had a passion for the Dunedin sound since I was a teenager. <laughs> yeah, there's so many good Dunedin bands and you know, one's bands that probably should have got more recognition but didn't. Um, didn't release a lot of stuff, some of them. Um, and there's, then there's the core of really cool Dunedin bands that put out a lot of stuff, toured the world, you know. Well, when I was living in Wellington, a lot of the Flying Nine bands would tour obviously and they'd usually do two nights in Wellington, the Friday, Saturday, and oh, there were so many through. Probably uh, the Chills in 1990, when they were at the sort of peak of their, peak of their powers, that was pretty memorable, yeah. I believe I've got probably one of the bigger live sort of material um, collections, on, particularly on tape and videotape as well, yeah.